is worth 350,000. Why didn't you give him more? Huh? Why didn't you give him any more? You were there beside me. Did you tell me to offer them more? Your brother was there as well. You should have all offered your fortunes when you had the chance. Am I making the decisions by myself? I would have offered all of it. I'd give everything, even my life, for Wait, the life Layla. of my son. Are you saying that I wouldn't give my life for my own son? Is that what you're saying? What the hell is going on? Mr. Marat, we can talk over here if, if you'd like to follow me. picture upstairs. Come on. Please, can you find me a small box? Get a clean box and put some mice in it, okay? Then put this in the freezer, will you? We'll need it to sew it back on when Kareem comes back. Please try. Kareem, my boy. Come on. My boy. These men are true psychopaths. Yes, they're true psychopaths. So what is this Mason doing while all this is going on? Is he called in? That's exactly what I wanted to talk to you about right now regarding that guy, Mason. Michael, I don't think that Mason is enough in this case. I wish we had just gone to the police. No way, Aaron. We will not be calling the police. Don't confuse anyone with that talk. My nephew's life is at stake. That's it. That's why I'm I telling you. I just said you. no. <laughs> Damn all you animals for this. Damn you all, I say. What on earth did you want from such a young boy? He never does anything. What has my boy done to you? Damn all of you animals to hell. Would cutting off his finger kill him? What are you asking? What kind of a question is that to ask? I don't know, Mom. I'm curious. Kenny. Son, stop making things worse right now. Okay, I'll keep my mouth shut then. And you don't beat yourself up so much. Your blood sugar levels are going to go up. Why has God put such a heavy weight on my shoulders? Why has he? If they never spoke to me as long as I lived, they would be right. I'm the one who handed their son so easily to those people. No, please don't talk so silly woman. You raised that boy like your own. No one said anything to you, okay? I'd feel better if they fired me having done this to them for losing their precious No, stop son. talking nonsense because you'll start to put ideas in their heads, woman. Yeah, if they decide to do that, the three of us will starve to death. God, please grant Mrs. Layla patience. How can a mother's heart bear a pain like this? Yeah, great people have great problems, my dear Alma. You know what they say? Great responsibility begets greater problems. Look, that's you, Mommy. That's Daddy. That's me. And that's my brother. Don't you like my drawing? I do. I really like it. It's lovely. 
Where's my brother? When will he be coming back? You remember we discussed it with your father last week. He's gone away to summer school for his English. Off in England. My brother didn't want to go, and Daddy shouted at him. Yes, that's true. But they made amends later. And your brother went happily. And without saying goodbye to me first? When will he be back, Mommy? We don't know that yet. He may come back early if he gets bored. Uh, maybe even in a few days' time. Honey, look how late it is. Let's have our cocoa and go to bed right now, yes? Huh? Will you read me a story first, Mama? Uh, this evening Alma will do it, huh, baby? Yes, of course, of course. Of course, sweetheart. I'll be reading you a story. Ah, oh, remember that we had a story that we didn't get to finish? And now, where did we hide that book? Let's see, where is it? Come on, my dear. Here it goes. Oh. Once upon a time, that's how it always starts. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to blame you for anything. It's only that... Okay, my love, okay. I know. What have we ever done to anyone to deserve this? Lord, please protect my son. He won't have lost a lot of blood, right? Will they have bandaged his wound? He's all right. Hello. Yeah, Mason. Hey, where have you been, man? We've been trying to reach you now for two hours. We've been going crazy with worry over here. The wicked bastards. Those men sent... Kareem's finger. They cut my son's finger off. Gerald, please try to remain as calm as you can now. Yeah. Wait for my call very soon. We're going to pick up Kareem now. You're on your way to get Kareem? Tell Layla she should stop worrying. God willing, I will bring Kareem home soon. Okay. Okay. Gerald, did he find my son? He said he was going to pick up Kareem. Uh, oh, thank God. <laughs> Hang on, though. How is he going to do this? Is he going on his own? Is he taking the police? Did he say anything? I don't know. I couldn't speak to him too much. But he said he was going. He must have someone with him. 